Yeah, we'll see. We're all, we're all geared up. All right, we're back. Back in the Badlands. Got beautiful scenery right behind me. Kind of unbelievable. But um, this may be the first ever medieval mace review. This is the Ib Iberian mace that we uh, we carry. It's an arms and armor mace. Notice the studs on it. Used to crush armor. Get a close-up look on the uh, how far out they go. Imagine that creasing armor, all the penetrating power of that if you had two hands or if you're using this in one hand as well. The actual tip of it is pinned in, in as pin construction on it. It's pinned together. That's very cool. We have a hardwood shaft to it. See, it's the whole length of my arm. Say this is about 28 inches all together. Got to watch my step behind here. There's no mistakes out here. And you'll see that a lot of the, obviously a lot of the weight is on the tip of it. So you really got to use your body to rotate, to be able to get this thing back around. Bam. It's not really that good for broken strikes. It just takes too long. But for fluid strikes, for overheads, two hands will work better. It's more like a medieval baseball bat, if anything, but uh, specifically used for as an anti-armor weapon. Mm -hmm. So since this one is pretty straightforward, I thought I'd give you guys a quick form. If you have a mace or a warhammer, anything like that, that's more of an anti-armor weapon. So you can train this form at home. So here's what we got. We're gonna start with the left leg forward, weapons in the right hand. We're gonna come out, strike one, two, three on the vertical, and we're gonna go a diagonal number one. Now we end this backhand position. One, two, three, and then we throw the two or back to the position that we started in. So let's take a look at it again. One two, three, and then you hit the diagonal. One, two, three, and then you hit the diagonal and you're back to the starting point. I'm gonna rotate it a few times so you can see it from different angles and that way you can catch all the beautiful scenery that we have over here right now. So let's do it. Okay, so there you have it, the Arms and Armor Iberian Mace. This may be the first ever mace review in the, uh, the Badlands of South Dakota. And I want you guys to let me know what you think of this weapon. See if you can comment below, subscribe to the channel, let me know what you think. I'll talk to you soon.